Powerwall owners can now monitor and manage all of Tesla's products with the Tesla mobile app. This is the Powerwall home screen, which shows you the overall status of your system. At the top, you can see if Powerwall is charging or discharging. If you have Solar and Powerwall, both will be visible, as in this example. If you only have Powerwall, then Solar will not be visible. At the bottom, you have a menu of options. You will see the Customize option. This screen reveals the menu of modes to choose from, which can include Backup Only, Self-Powered, and Advanced Time-Based Control. In Backup Only mode, your backup reserve is set to 100%, and your Powerwall will prioritize charging from any available solar energy or grid energy, if your utility allows this. In other modes, you'll be able to customize your backup reserve percentage. In self-powered mode, Powerwall will store solar energy during the day and discharge at night. Advanced time-based control is for anyone who pays different prices for electricity during the day. Check your utility bill to see if this applies to your home. If you have solar installed, you will see two modes of operation, balanced and cost saving. Select Balance to charge only with solar. Powerwall will keep your self-powered percentage high while shifting energy from inexpensive times to expensive times. Select Cost Saving to maximize your savings, which may mean you will use less of your self-generated solar energy. If you have Powerwall without solar, there is only a single advanced time-based control mode available. You do not need to make a selection. Use Edit Price Schedule to set the peak, expensive, and off-peak, inexpensive times to match your utility rate plan. You can set a different schedule for the week and weekends. It takes up to one hour for Powerwall to adapt to any changes you make in these modes. From the home screen, select Power Flow. This screen reveals how much power is generated from your solar panel system and the direction the energy is flowing to your home or power wall. If solar is producing more power than the home and power wall can use, that power will be exported back to the grid. It's important to understand that power wall itself will not export power back to the grid. You can touch the solar, home, power wall, or grid icons to access more information, or you can select the graph icon at the top. Once you do that, you will see a more detailed breakdown of how you are producing and using energy. Change from today to yesterday to see a full day's view. This first graph in blue shows energy consumed by the home. You can see there was a spike right before 4 a.m. This is when an electric car was set to charge. You can see the multiple morning spikes at around 8 a.m. This is when you're waking up, turning on lights, running the coffee maker, and completing your morning routine. There are other peaks throughout the day, and then in the evening we see multiple spikes, starting at around 6 p.m., when you begin preparing dinner, watching TV, working on your computer, and so on. If you scroll down, you can see the exact breakdown from solar, power wall, and the grid. If you touch the solar icon, you can see the solar production for the day. As you scroll down, you'll see how much solar energy was produced and where it was used. Let's select the power wall icon. You will see the green spike to the left, which shows that the electric vehicle did most of its charging from power wall. As we are generating solar power, some of that energy is used instantaneously by the home, and the surplus is used to charge power wall which is reflected by the green curve dropping below the x-axis. The sharp end of the curve shows that Powerwall has reached full charge. Then in the evening, after the sun goes down, Powerwall automatically starts discharging. The green curve is positive, showing that energy is going from Powerwall to your home. You can then see how much energy has come from Powerwall. Let's look at the grid icon. You will notice that the gray grid goes into the negative. This indicates Powerwall is fully charged and the extra power from solar was fed back to the grid. You can then see in the latter half of the day, 
Powerwall supports the entire home and you do not have to use any utility power. If you scroll down, you will see how much energy was sent back to the grid. From the Home menu, select Self-Powered to understand how much of your home energy needs were self-produced from solar and power wall versus pulled from the utility grid. If you select Yesterday, you can see where your energy came from and realize you're relying less on utility power. From the Home screen menu, select Backup History to see how many times there was a utility outage. Since Powerwall instantaneously switches over and provides backup power to your home, you will not even realize there was an outage. Here, you can see the day and time a grid outage occurred and know that your home was protected. If you're in need of any additional assistance, please contact Tesla Powerwall Support.